Hi, I'm just doing an unboxing session of the new Motorola G. Uh, it's fresh out of the box. So, this is what you get obviously, the phone. And you just get a sync cable, no charger, but you'll have enough of those already. And quick start guide and just the usual bump that you normally get with it. So nothing nothing amazing there. Uh, right, I'd, I'd say this phone isn't a review sample. This is my own phone. I personally bought it myself. Uh, strangely enough, on the UK price, it's £135. But for some reason, if you buy a top-up card, They'll sell it to you for £125 if you buy a £10 top up card. So, you know. Bit weird, but there you go. Anyway, so what do you get? You get a 4.7 millimeter, I'm sorry, a 4.7 inch screen with Gorilla Grass. And for the price, it's really good. It's running KitKat 4.3 and they say they'll be giving you an update to 4.4 uh, in the new year. But, you know, as with Android, when it happens, I'll be amazed. Quality-wise, it's a good, solid feel. The back is removable and you can have various colours but uh, as of yet I haven't uh, seen any any online yet but uh, it's only come out yesterday so we'll have to see about the phone you've got a 5 megapixels camera with LED flash on the back and a 1.3 megapixel camera front facing uh, also you can't see it on here but you do have a LED notification for when emails or text messages come through, which is good. You don't have to keep turning the phone off and on. Um, what can I say? I'm quite impressed with it. Uh, Battery-wise, they say it lasts for two days, and I've been trying it, and I've run YouTube solidly for three hours, and I came down to about 30% power. So it, their claim looks all right. Uh, one thing about the battery, it's a non-removable battery. You have to live with it. So if something goes wrong with it, you probably have to send it away to get it done. And the SIM card is now the micro SIM card. So, yet again, I've had to have my card, my normal size SIM card, is going to be replaced with a micro SIM card. Um, the basics of the phone. It does all the good things. It seems to be running um, stock Android. So it's got very few Motorola add-ons. So what you get is a good, uh, good, you know, a good solid bit of Android with all the usual Google goodness. Um, as for changing this phone, you can do through the Android marketplace. You go and you have a... Motorola migrate so it'll take all your settings and um, phone calls and text messages and you'll migrate it from one phone to the other. Uh, I'll be giving a demonstration of this once I get it going but um, as for now I'm quite impressed with the phone. It's, it's a good solid feel and so far, so good. I should put in uh, demonstrations of the video and the camera ability in later when I get a bit of sunlight. But as for now, that's what I'm getting. Thank you.